So the boss lady's here in the LIG booth and I've just been told this is Ebony and Ivory and East Coast, West Coast. Right. So you guys handle the marketing for the brand. Yes, what do you basically do every day? Every day we basically try to forecast the market, target every TV show, video, magazine that we can find. Um, cross, cross brand, you know, Ivory is very good at that. <laughs> Just you know, explore new avenues, you know, get presence in new areas that we're not familiar with, you know, such as, you know, the motorsports world with our new Habuza Suzuki collaboration. So, you know, just constantly look for the next freshest thing no matter what it is, you know, whatever field that, that person might be, whether they're an artist, a skateboarder, just looking for someone pushing the envelope, raising the bar. We've just been told that we need to interview Ben. Hi Ben, I'm Simone from drjays.com. The boss lady, are you the boss man? You look like it, you look like it. Just a regular dude, you know, Ben Baller. Regular dude, sweetheart. Not many regular dudes are doing this right here. Tell me, talk to me. What do you do? What's your piece? Um, I own a jewelry business, and uh, basically, uh, Everett from Jonas. I've made pieces for him, for Tom Cruise, Paris Hilton, Cole Ritchie, all the way down to the game, Fat Joe, Scott Storch, to Nas, and a bunch of people like that. And um, represent, I basically represent LRG as, you know, like, internet poster child. You know what I'm saying? I mean, people have wrote about me from Karma Loop to DrJays.com to Hypebeast to you name it. I just try to keep brand awareness out there for LRG, and I'm here for many reasons. One, to support my best friend Jonas, co-CEO, co-founder. Two, to show people, you know, that we're doing bigger things than just, you know, the clothing lines and stuff like this Casio G-Shock LRG collaboration. You know, so it's, it's only made by... Can I ask you something? Are they real diamonds? Yeah, everything's real. They're real diamonds? Wow. Let me, let me ask you a real question though. Someone like you, someone like Jonas, self-made successful men that are obviously proud of their success. I know a lot of young people would look at you and be like, man, you're rubbing it in our face. You're very ostentatious. Who's the real Ben Baller? Like, are you just a regular dude that made it and no, you're not regular? <laughs> I mean, I mean, you don't see me wear mink coats and shit like that. You know what I mean? But see, the thing is, at the end of the day, I'm a father, you know what I mean? I spend time with my kid, I don't really go out, I don't party, you don't see me in the news acting stupid. I'm here promoting my jewelry at the same, at the end of the day, I don't really wear jewelry all the time, you know, like I have my earrings on and I have a watch on, but I'm chill, like I ride bikes, that's what I like to do, you know what I'm saying? I like to sun in cars and have fun, but really, you see me, I'm in a t-shirt and jeans. But this I mean, is your game face right yeah. now, you need to come out and promote and this is what you do, like you said, you don't wear this every day at home yeah. or whatever. It's only for, you know, real talk, that's, that's just, that's me. Yeah. I can't be on a motorcycle, I, you know, I, I'm not, you're not going to see me wearing, I'm, I'm just a regular dumb, I'm being t-shirt and jeans and that's just me. Right. Well, it was great to meet you, Ben. Thank you very much and all the best with everything you do.